Hi guys, hope you're well and welcome to this commission showcase video. We have a real treat for you today. We have the Primark, the man, the legend, the mighty Lee Man Russ. Now, if you're new to Siege Studios YouTube channel, then firstly welcome Siege Studios is a UK-based premium commission miniature painting service with 30 members of staff who all paint to our various selection of levels, starting at bronze, which is our minimum standard at an above tabletop quality, moving all the way up to platinum, which is a competition entry quality. If you are interested in the commission with us here at Siege, and all you need to do very simply is head to the description of this video where it says get a quote. Click on that link, it takes you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form. And on there, all you need to do is select the relevant drop down options from those that are available. And in the message section, include a list of models in our model list format. Uh, once that's completed and done, fire that off to us to get a quote back to us and get the process started. We're back in a second to have a look at the mighty Lee Man Russ in more detail. See you guys back in a sec. So let's dive in and have a look at this awesome, awesome Primark platinum level character commission, which we've had the pleasure of working on for our client. Uh, to start off with, this, hot, this Lee Man Russ has been painted by Adam, one of the senior team here at Siege that paints some of our platinum level projects. Uh, a really, really awesome model, just to start off with, without any further sort of chatting about the paint work, first of all, uh, really, really shows what Lee Man Russ is, the man, the legend that he is. Uh, absolute ferocious pose, charging forward, weapon in each hand. Again, a really, really lovely, lovely finish on him. I'm just going to get us to focus for you guys. See, Adam's done a stellar job just doing all the non-metallics across the sword, the armour trims, and also the armour as well. was also done in a non-metallic metal uh, as well. Um, one of my favourite points, and you can, I'm glad you can see it here on camera, is the blue kind of glow from the power of the sword. It's just glazed and refracting on that leg, on that thigh there. If we just move that around, you've got a lovely blue tinge on that leg from the underside of the sword, just refracting on the armour, which is really, really lovely. Uh, all the facial details painted through loads and loads of uh, highlighting stages with all the little details and everything fully done on him as well. We've got this lovely non-metallic copper on the backpack as well, on the wolf heads. Uh, moving around, you can see all the little details and trinkets are all fully painted to a lovely, lovely standard. Uh, every aspect of detail having hours of work spent on it to get it to this super high competition quality. Uh, also got the lovely NMM there on the axe, uh, both the glow and also on the blades with catch lights and little blooms of light as well all over it. Um, again, every little detail with hours invested into it to get it to this super, super, super high standard. Um, and again, you can see the armour there, this lovely blue and purple tinge on the armour, just at that sort of approach to make giving it a little bit of extra interest to the grey and blue kind of colour that it is. Uh, but little bits of damage and weathering also done on there as well, which is really lovely. Um, obviously, Russ is decked out with weapons. We've got that little knife there as well, uh, with its scabbard and the skull, all done to a really, really high quality. Um, I do specifically like the little green gem that he's got flying around in his hair, which is quite cool. Just picked out in a lovely complimentary green as well, uh, just so it really stands out. Uh, again, the base as well. We've got the uh, Forge World base here with those pillars from uh, the Thousand Suns home world as well, just knocked over as he's uh, charging forward. Uh, which is really nice. You've got the copper just on that flooring as well, those sort of runes and things that have also been done. Thousand Suns helmet there. You couldn't have Russ without a victim on the on his base either. Uh, but again, just to give you a bit more closer detail here, all the hours that are invested into the non-metallics on here, plus all the, all the blending that has been done uh, to show all the catch lights, point of light sourcing and uh, refraction of glows and things, which is really, really stellar. Just move from a bit of a top-down view just so you can see him from there uh, in this really cool pose. The model is absolutely gorgeous, like really, really lovely model before we even talk about the painting, as I have said. Um, you know, really emphasizes what Russ is and what how Russ's attitude and sort of uh, personality are in one pose, I think. Uh, again, really nice rotation here, just so you can see every little bit of detail and uh, no expense has been spared on this at all whatsoever. He's, a, he's absolutely covered in weapons. He's got that little hatchet there on his back, which I really, really like. Uh, again, another little complimentary green gem there just on the, just trailing down amongst the uh, fur on his cape as well. Do really, really like the shield as well. You can see all the NMM that's done on there as well. And uh, again, moving around just all the little trims and everything done to a super, super, super high fashion. Uh, now with all our platinum character jobs, uh, we do give the client a plinth as well to display the uh, the character on as well, as these are competition quality display pieces. Um, again, just to show you guys, it is all magnetized, so the whole entire base, you can rotate him on here as well. And it's a very strong magnet that we put on just so that you can uh, so that you can separate the model from the base here. And that just attaches on as well for our client. Uh, again, it's all sunken, so you can tip the model and uh, you know it's uh, it's thoroughly secure just for display purposes. Uh, again, and if, if our client wishes to then obviously game with this model, then they can do so as well. Uh, but uh, again, 
Really, really lovely finish. Just look at this angle here. You can see the lovely red ball follies pad as well with all the little gems and things on there. All the facial details done in a really, really lovely fashion as well. But overall, super high quality finish on this awesome Lehman Rust that we've had the pleasure of working on for our client. Uh, I do hope you guys like it. I'm going to come back in a second just to discuss, obviously, how you can take out a character commission with us as we do specialise in those, uh, be it at any of our character levels, so silver, gold or platinum like Lehman Rust here. Uh, we're back in a second. See you guys back in a sec. So thanks for checking the video out, guys. I really appreciate it ever so much. And I do hope that you've liked this awesome character Primark showcase video of Lehman Russ. I know that Adam had a great time working on him. Uh, again, this is a really good example of our platinum level here at Siege. Um, if you are interested in making your favorite character or hero the centerpiece of your collection uh, for the rest of your life, then this is the level and we are the company to come to. Um, now, if you are interested in a quote with us for be it a character at platinum or any of our character levels, gold or silver, then all you need to do very simply is head to the description of this video uh, where you can find a link that takes you directly to the Siege Studios website and our contact form. Once you're there, all you need to do very simply is select all the relevant drop down options from those that are available and uh, in the message section include a list of models in our model list format and file it off to us to get a quote. While you're here on YouTube, there's a huge favour and subscribe to the channel so you can keep up to date with all of the videos that, that we do put up. Uh, if you do hit that bell icon, you will be notified when new videos do go up. In the description also, you will find all the links to our social media, so Instagram, Facebook and Twitter. Please go give us a like and follow respectively on those. And finally, let us know how much you love Space Wars by dropping a comment below. I'll see you guys back very soon in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.